In this video, we will provide an overview of the People section in Drupal. Click on the People link in the Administration toolbar. It takes you to the People area of your Drupal site. You will see multiple tabs on this page. Let us look at each tab. The List tab displays the usernames of the users of the website. Here, the username of the administrator is Course Admin. Click on Edit to view or update the details. An active status indicates that the user can log in to the site. To block a user account, you can change the status to Blocked. Note that an account can have multiple roles at the same time. By default, personal contact forms are enabled for users. This functionality is configurable. You can also decide to disable personal contact forms. Note that the time zone setting affects the date and time format the user sees. Select the appropriate time zone and save the changes. Click the Roles tab. Here, you will see a list of roles that are present in Drupal. You can also create a new role by clicking Add Role. Every role has its own set of permissions. To view the list of permissions assigned to each role, click the Permissions tab. Scroll down to gain an overview of all available permissions. The last tab is Role Settings. To access this tab, you need to have a permission named Administer Permissions. Here, you can select the role to which all permissions will be granted. In this video, we provided an overview of the People section in Drupal.